the river Nile dried up during the seven years of famine. Now, so you realize that because God wanted a position for his servant, he dried up the Nile for seven years. And by reason of divine intelligence, Joseph was able to make up for the seven years of famine. And so let us jump over. There was also a goddess called the goddess Heket. And his duty was to see that productivity and fertility was encountered in Israel. Remember that the Israelites had been there for 460 years. It was only their color that gave them up, their language that gave them up, their height that gave them, that gave them up, and their culture that gave them up. Apart from that, they had now adopted all the elements of Egypt and they were behaving like the Egyptians. And so before God segregates them and takes them on a different tangent and a different journey, God must first of all deal with the goddess called Hackett. They believe if I can have a child, then this goddess must be in charge. If I can prosper, then this goddess must be in charge. If I can advance, then this goddess must be in charge. If I can be fruitful, then this goddess must be in charge. But then God stands and God realizes that not until I deal with the power of the frog, there is no way that when my people exit, they will still believe that I am the Lord that blesses. I'm talking about supernatural advantage. So the Bible says, and then Aaron stretches forth the rod, and then frogs started coming out of the waters. Frogs started coming up everywhere. Everywhere, the whole land was covered with frogs. And my first point, before I finish with my second point, and then he called for his soothsayers and his fetish priests. And he said, do same and take away the frogs. And the interesting thing is, the more they were chanting, the more, if God gave them one million frogs, they also added 200,000 frogs to it. When they were asked to solve the problem, they came and compounded the problem. Can I prophetically tell you something? From this year till the end of the year, anyone that wants to add up a problem to your problems will be compounding their own problems in the name of Jesus. Hey, 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 hey. They will say, let us write these letters about him. Let us try to do this about him. Let us go and pray against him. I've been having text messages of pastors gathering to pray against me and against my ministry and against my family. I've been having test messages of late. I've been having so many things, so many test messages. But let me tell you one thing. The Lord spoke to me and he told me that when they want to heap up problems for you, ladies and gentlemen, they will be contributing to their own problems. They were hired to solve their problem. Little did they know that they had come on the scene to complicate their own problems. May I be prophetic this morning? It doesn't matter who it is. It can be a policeman. It can be a military man. It can be a politician. Regardless of what they do, I speak on this altar that they are complicating their own problems. If you are the target, I came to tell you that it shall complicate their own problems. It shall complicate their own problems. It shall complicate their own problems. Lift up your hands and shout yes. Because already, the power to bring fertility to enchantment has been broken. That is a supernatural advantage that you have. Many a times, before the frogs appear, break them down in your office. That by the reason 
of the fact that you know the advantage you have in the spirit you are easily able to contain the frogs why because you have a supernatural advantage the goddess has to be destroyed every god in egypt has to be destroyed their power has to be destroyed that when israel exits yes egypt may be found in them but the power of egypt will not be in them you didn't get it we are going through a process of identifying every power in egypt so you realize that they shall go and yes they will remember egypt but watch this they will not remember the powers of egypt if the powers of egypt were not broken they will have been drawn back by the powers of egypt but because the powers of egypt were broken ladies and gentlemen they were never drawn back yes they could remember and make references but there is no power behind this reference i came to tell you that some may utter words against you but there shall not be any power behind your words they shall conspire against you but there shall not be any power behind your conspiracy oh i'm talking about supernatural advantage are you here with me are you here with me they shall set traps for you but there shall not be any power behind your traps i thought i was coming to speak to somebody today i thought i was coming to speak to somebody who has so many people up against you because of the cause of god that you are embarking upon but i came prophetically to tell you yes we may remember egypt but the power of egypt shall be broken before we remember egypt the power of the nile which is their source of economy was broken that is why israel will go on the promised land they will go with so much wealth although they were not working why because the power of the economy have been revoked and given to them now the power of the frog of the goddess that was in charge of fertility let me tell every one of you here as i wind up the power of your fertility is not in the family from which you come from watch this you can inherit your high blood pressure from your father father that's your choice you can inherit um, diabetes from your father that is your choice you can inherit poverty from your mother that is your choice but from today break that power of the goddess it should not have authority over you it should not have an influence over you i wish i was coming to church i wish i came to church i could have i could have responded better to myself ah seven days after the change of the river into blood the frogs also appeared let me tell you this as i wind up the same hand that dealt with the blood of the nile shall deal with the head of hecate some of you for the testimonies you have you should not be scared of the challenges you are encountering i don't think you heard me i don't know how i can say it well i said some of you here for the testimonies you have you cannot be enslaved by the challenges you confront because the, the testimony is so much that every doctor said you cannot have a child you didn't do an IVF you did nothing seven years after marriage somewhere somehow you find out ah, you are still seeing your menses but the doctor said 
you were pregnant. And then this child falls sick and the doctors tell you this child has leukemia. If that child dies, it is your fault. If you have a testimony that everybody said you cannot have a child, but somewhere, somehow, God gave you one. When you go to the hospital and they tell you your child has leukemia, tell them the God that dealt with the blood can deal with the frog. Some of you, for the testimonies you have, you are not even the favorite of your own biological mother and your own biological father. Your own mother called you a failure. But some way, somehow, today look at you. You have become a superstar. Say, And so, who show a brabo more? One man who now cry, no phone, no phone, no phone, no phone. Now, why a kama, 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 kama? And I say, I say, one daddy at the sun, no be a cow, no adan man on daddy, not the be a wujina, so kama, 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 and to a hoon chomu, maybe a catcher will say, send your meal so mu, kakra, 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 no, send your mikrona, and obey the fufro in your life. That is why me, for what I've seen, I'm the last person to be threatened. No, 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 no. Regardless of your power, regardless of your influence, no. I was talking to one of my sons who is a president. He said, Victor, you are too confident. What is the source of your confidence? And I said, the source of my confidence is the source of where I'm coming from. within seven days he dries up the whole rivers and at the end one said one after the six day on the seventh day and so you clear the frogs away from you but watch this it is not just the event and the element it is the spiritual interpretation of what your god is doing in your life Amen. what does it mean it means the power of the nile baby i do hear your question you know where you what makes your business flourish and prosper? The fertility. The goddess Hecate was in charge of their fertility in business, fertility in ministry, fertility in their Christian lives. It was solely in charge. But ladies and gentlemen, its power was broken the day the frogs appeared. Adiebi wabushi emwa. Eyi yeye friwa. On the say on my ye to me banner. May that power be broken. And may the source of your fertility be God and nothing short of it. I came to tell you today that you should only cry if you don't have access to God. You should only cry. Regardless of who lives your life and who says all kinds of things against you, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You know what matters? The most thing, the most in, uh, important person that matters in your life is God. And the second person is yourself. That's okay. I'm not being heartless. I want you to understand that. Na said ya na usi ni ukuru party yi. Obi e ni mse ji se owo na betete mo ntem. Se be men na oboa. Wonu mu wie ya odi usi ka wie ye. Oya o se aduma asuma me oboa se na ordinary ba akoko. 
ejuma suma me takwa no de natari ba akoko unu ye no within 3 months no asisa ne nyoma nyina no de ko afi de ona osi we yi ko fini ho me ye den jai su jai su jankomo me ne una me ne una ma febo me si jai su jankomo me ne una Hallelujah. It doesn't matter the frogs that show up. Nyamia would do now some kunim no kai se obeti me di in punch and in some kunim. The kofia wini na chi wa madam. Oda soti ase ne yeni so be madam. Tina me kache muse se be me jawa wadia ne se o koshe dem na unkuana se o suana uti anywhere ni na ekakraka afe di o sense of taste ni na ne ko. Dressing in an echo, I feel you'll be an hour shampa boy yesterday. Oh, sorry, I'm Pabu said Gregua. He's our fan Pabu Achiatia. Which me do nine shampa cum Pabu Bakum, not do nine shampa Bafu from Hey, Jadi Ochechen. Jai Yehoah, men, Yehoah, men, Yehoah, men,